Faro has been um, a discovery of a new dynamic and Faro gave me uh, the feedback of the people. Uh, it showed me how, how creative and dynamic they can be, how they feel about, um, about their heritage. And so I, I was convinced when I saw the examples of people who were working uh, in the spirit of Faro, I was convinced that it is the future. It's the only future possible because the way we have managed heritage doesn't work anymore. Well, the first thing is that people get involved. It is an emotional link. There, uh, a group, a sort of spirit of group forms, and and so um, it is. It, it is like an energy that uh, helps you to to make real the projects, to follow, to 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 make them work. If what is happening uh, may look uh, banal or may look something very small, they have more motivation to go on. So it is like starting a movement that feeds itself with the results. Doesn't matter if the results are small. Well, in my opinion, it would be to keep in track with uh, the way society is moving. And the examples I've seen from Faro are uh, new ways, new creative ways of, of um, facing the reality we have now and, uh, and positive ways of facing this reality. And I think that the countries are, the governments are now uh, a bit lost in that sense. And if, if they ratified, is they, they would uh, be part of this change. We have to work more uh, and, and show them practical examples so that they realize it is, uh, it is valuable and it's useful to ratify it, not to stay behind. <laughs>